everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Maria Williams and this is my Maria. Today I have another Dollar Tree haul for you. If you're subscribed, thank you for so much for being here. If you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button and the bell notification button so that you're notified every time that I upload. Um, I have a lot of exciting things to show you today, so let's get started. The first few things I'm going to show you are from the gardening section. Um, I found something that was so worth $1.25. Um, I'm going to be using it this year in my garden. And this is the first part. This is $1.25 for this handle. But it comes with three different attachments. The um, Dollar Tree by my house only had two attachments. So it had the shovel and it attaches like that. And then it also had this um, rake. I didn't know if they called it something different because it does have the actual um, big fan uh, leaf rake, but my store did not carry that one. So I'll be looking for that also. So you do have to buy it in different sections, but it's still worth $1.25. It seems to be pretty sturdy. The rake does not bend. And then it just pops on with, hmm, I guess it screws on actually. I thought it, there were holes, so I thought that it like popped on and you had to, but it actually screws on. So that was exciting. And then I also picked up the garden tool hanger. And that is um, to hang this and the little attachments. If you have a, if you're, you like to be organized, then this is something neat to hang up. And then you just mount this on the wall, screw it into your wall. Um, the other, for gardening that I picked up were the, they're still four for a dollar and it's the seeds. I got tomato, radishes, squash, and peppers. And then I also picked up these gardening gloves. I love them. They are butterflies. They are so perfect for me. Um, me and my daughters all have butterfly tattoos. And they're special. These are special. Um, the last garden thing that I picked up was this for my cherry tomatoes. It is $1.25. And it's a trellis. Um, let's do a couple food items. I picked up these mini Snyder pretzels. And this is a Knott's bag, name brand. They have all kinds of Snyder's at the Dollar Tree, normal size bags. Um, I have not seen this at the Dollar Tree before, um, but it is a plain pound cake, and they also have a marble one, but I only picked up plain. Um, if I was going to eat it, I, was, I would have picked up the marble one because I like chocolate, but I'm not going to eat it. So um, I picked up the regular... My husband and kids will eat this. Um, I also picked up some aluminum foil, Reynolds wrap. These are foil sheets. I have not used these yet. Um, I'm gonna try them out, but I they are 14 inches by 10, 10.25 inches, so I'm pretty sure that that'll cover a casserole dish. Um, so I'm gonna try that. And then the next thing I picked up were these tooth and gum wipes by Fisher Price. I am going to be putting that into a gift basket. And then pacifier and toy wipes. And these are just gonna be handy in your diaper bag um, to have when you're out and about and the baby drops the pacifier or the baby's having you know, gum issues and not hurting. And you could just gently rub. Um, let's see what they say. Safe cleaning, the, to the pacifier and toy wipes, safe cleaning for toys and baby accessories. 
And then the gum wipe safe cleaning for baby's teeth and gums. I don't know if it gives you like a um, fluoride free, sugar free with xylitol um, ingredients, aqua xylitol. Oh, I can't pronounce half of that. <laughs> and then this says paraben free, sulfate free, chlorine free. Not tested on animals, and that is for the pacifier and toy wipes. Um, the next thing that I picked up was this shampoo massager. Um, it's got a little handle on it, and these are kind of rubbery, but they're firm. So I picked up the green one. There was also a pink one, um, but I love my head getting massaged. I don't know about myself massaging it, um, but I'm going to try it out and see if I like it. The next thing that I picked up was a veggie brush. Um, I wash my fruits and vegetables in the sink, but I've never thought of scrubbing them. Um, you know, you just usually just, just kind of like lightly rinse them. I have scrubbed apples um, for candy apples, but I'm, I'm pretty sure I need to do a little bit more cleaning my fruits and vegetables than what I normally do since I'm noticing that there's a brush for that. I did not realize that. Um, the next thing I picked up was, I don't know if um, they have this on a regular basis, but this is a 60 second digital thermometer. And for $1.25, everybody needs a thermometer. And so I picked that up and I'm gonna see how well that works. We use it, um, especially when we're having um, puppies to take the dam's temperature. So uh, I'd like to see how this works. And yeah, it's just a thermometer. The next thing that I picked up was the Be Pure Non-Medicated Blemish Patches. And the directions are to cleanse the problem area and then dry and then you put the little patch over the blemish and the next day it should be um, not gone away completely, but better. So um, I'm sure one of the kids will need this and we'll try it out and then I'll let you know how that goes. And then these are health and beauty. And I picked up essential tools and this is 12 rainbow applicators for your um, eyeshadow. I know that a lot of palettes don't have eyeshadow applicators and then when you're doing your friend's makeup or something like that, you always like to have, you know, ones that you're not going to use over and over again. You could maybe throw them away. Um, my daughter's getting ready to go to a model boot camp, so um, I picked these up for her for that day. It's a 12-hour day. I also found this Diamond Cosmetics um, Wide Board Grinder. It's a file, nail filer. It's just big and kind of um, flashy. I thought it would be cute to pull out of your purse when you're somewhere, you know, and then sitting there real cute filing your nails. So I picked that up also. And then I picked up these sunglasses, and these have like a little bit of a red hue to it. I like these ones the best, probably out of all the sunglasses that I've picked up this year. Um, that, and then I picked up this pair, which I thought they were cute. Sit on the beach with, or even just sunbathe with. But you can see, can you see that? That those are like little hearts. You can't really t tell from that side, but when I look at them to put them on, you can see that they're little hearts. I just thought that that was cute. And then I found this sensory zipper fidget bracelet. 
and I have a little birthday party that I'm going to this weekend and I'm going to put that on her package. So it looks like there's three bracelets in one. And it's just something, a little sensory thing for you to fidget with. And that's it. I went through that pretty quick. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching.